Hello everybody on YouTube, it's Michael here again and this is the second and final part of showing off the 20 rhythm styles on this Yamaha PSR 40 keyboard. Here we go.
So that's the 20 built-in rhythms of the PSR 40 keyboard and the five and the five bass and chord variations and the three drums variations if you watched my previous videos as well and the 16 voices as well if you watched the video of that as well I hope you've enjoyed the, this um, video and the other videos that I've done of this keyboard and its features now before I go there is um, I've got a small update to my keyboards collection showing that I've recently got two more keyboards added to the collection and I'll show you what they are I'll zoom in because um, I don't have batteries for this video recorder it's on the adapter so I'll zoom into the keyboards um, if you can see clearly on this keyboard um, this one was given to me by a customer from work this is a Yamaha B200 keyboard um, released in 1988 it's basically a DX7 with speakers it's got FM voices in, from the DX7 and also it also has what the um, DX7 didn't have was built-in reverb effects um, on this B200 here you have um, you have a hundred preset patches and I believe you have a hundred user patches and there's also a hundred patches on the um, card as well on this um, keyboard or synthesizer so as this was given to me by a customer from work um, the card that I've got given with this keyboard the internal battery is dead so I don't have the sounds from the card although I, I do have the card for this keyboard but I don't have the sounds in it because of the internal battery um, has run out pretty much but all in all it's a good synthesizer it's quite unusual for a synthesizer to have built-in speakers <laughs> so yes I will sit down and play this keyboard and get to know it a bit more it's really good that I got given this and um, I think it might be rare because I don't I haven't really seen any of these around so it was just my luck I got given this so here is the Yamaha B200 and the last keyboard on the update on this collection here we have let me just zoom out a little there we go and we have the PSR 6000 I've been looking for this keyboard for quite some time and now I've got it on this keyboard here you have 128 voices and 128 custom voices in which you can create effects and voices yourself and you have 50 rhythm styles and this keyboard is like the PSR 5700 because it has four variations per style and it has interactive accompaniment as well so if you leave the keyboard alone you don't touch the keyboard it will play solos for you which is the interactive accompaniment and you have a you have floppy disk drive a um, couple a few months ago I won a box of floppy disks for this keyboard and now the floppy disks for the PSR 6000 are not easy to come across so I was lucky I won those <laughs> I managed to win them before I got the keyboard and I also got floppies for the PSR 5700 and you have 21 demonstration songs in which I think I will show you on the next video of mine so that you can have a taster of what this keyboard sounds like so it's an alright keyboard I still think However, in my opinion, the PSR 5700 is better. But still, the PSR 6000 is good. So here is the Yamaha PSR 6000 and on top the B200. I would walk up to the keyboard, but this video recorder is on an adapter, not battery operated. So hopefully you can see okay as I zoomed in.
So adding those two keyboards to my collection that all together adds a total 119 keyboards added to my collection. It would have been 120, but I managed to sell I managed to sell my PSR E413 now because I replaced it with a PSR E443. So that's my small update to my keyboards collection. And there's the PSR 40 keyboard. Again, I do hope you have enjoyed the sounds and features of this keyboard if you've watched my previous videos. Um, write back to me and tell me what you think. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye for now.